Hi everyone, thanks so much for coming back to my channel. This is Tina with Tina's Craft Creations. I'm on today with a small Walmart haul. Um, my best friend and I went up to Erie, Pennsylvania over the weekend and we did run into Walmart and of course I found a couple of crafty-ish type of things. Um, so I wanted to just show you guys what I got. Um, the first thing is actually from the back to school section. Um, I thought these were absolutely beautiful and I bought them to use for crafting but they are actually folders but they're iridescent and they have these holographic stars on them but it's like a pinkish blue iridescent with the, it doesn't have the stars on the other side but I thought I could cut these apart so it has pink looks pink depending on the way the light hits it and blue and other lights but these are so beautiful and then they're just the little pockets inside. So I'm gonna cut these up so I can use this as like paper. And they're thick, you know, like normal, like little school folders. But I bought six of these because I thought they were so pretty. Um, so yeah, I got those. They were like, I think they were $1.24 a piece. So not too, too bad. And then I also got this other folder, which I'm gonna use for um, something uh, else I thought this was so pretty this reminds me of the Bloom Street collection from Pink Paisley and Paige Evans um there was a paper in that collection that had this like geometric design and these like pastel colors it was really beautiful but this is just a plastic folder um I got this actually for travel um I'm one of those people that even though you I have everything on my phone I like to print out like itineraries and boarding passes and all that because God forbid if something happened to my phone, if it breaks, if it's um, it's stolen, if it's in my purse and my purse gets stolen or whatever. I like to have a printout of all my documents in like a folder. So I thought this would be good um, to have on hand for, um, for my upcoming trips later this year. And yeah, it's really pretty. So that's why I got it. And again, it was only like a dollar something. So really, really pretty. Okay, so I did make my way back to the um, crafty section, but also in the regular, like, school, not school supplies, but the regular, like, office supplies, they have these beautiful notebooks out. Um, this one is pink with little succulents all over it and gold foiling, and I know I need a new notebook, like, I need a hole in the head, but I really liked this, and I went ahead and got it. It was only, like, four dollars and something, and, and I noticed that at Target, their notebooks are super expensive, so I never usually buy them there, but um, I saw this one. I thought it was really pretty, so I went ahead and bought it. And speaking of notebooks, <laughs> I bought a second one because look at this notebook. It's so pretty. It has this like plastic um, cover on the front and the back, and it's got just uh, lined paper as well. And again, it was like $4 and something, but oh my gosh, it's so pretty. Like, it is absolutely gorgeous. So I got those two notebooks and the regular, like, office supplies. Okay, in the crafty section, I found um, this really pretty Waverly um, one yard of fabric. Now, this is actually, like, a travel, like, a French Paris-themed kind of fabric. And I thought this would be really cute to have on hand to either make an album and put fabric over it or make a little bag or something. But it is so pretty. Even it has a little cat there and it has, you know, the Eiffel Tower, the Arc de Triomphe. Um, it's so pretty. And lots of other historical buildings that I can't think of the names of right now. Um, but this, I thought this fabric was so pretty and I love the colors. And um, I think their fab, their like one yard like packages weren't, weren't very much like less than maybe three or four dollars something like that but yeah I thought that was so pretty so I got that and then I also found in the craft section these hello hobby a2 cards and envelopes in this holographic paper and it comes with the envelopes and the blank cards and I never make my own envelopes so I thought these would be good to have on hand if I want to do like a decorated envelope or something and then I can just use the cards for whatever I'm trying not to blind you guys with the glare but I actually picked up two of these you get 12 cards and envelopes in each so I got those and then uh, also I found this really cute little patch it says crazy cat lady because you guys know I love cats and I thought that was really really cute so I got that to have just for myself and then the last thing I got is totally not craft related but you guys might think it's funny and I thought it was really kind of funny and cute 
But um, we were, my best friend and I were walking around the store and we walked past the toy department and they had these on this display and he grabbed one because he wanted to buy one for his mom. And I was like, oh my God, I need one too. <laughs> it's a little Golden Girls set of the little people. Um, and oh my gosh, how stinking cute are they? Like they have Sophia and it says picture it. Sicily 1912, Dorothy, not now ma. Um, Blanche, I need a cheesecake, and um, <laughs> Rose, it's like we say in St. Olaf. I love this so much. I have the Golden Girls Funko Pops, and I just thought these would be cute to have as like just part of my little like girl Golden Girls collection. But they're so stinking cute. So that is uh, all from my Walmart haul. If anyone has any questions, please let me know. If you have not already, I'd greatly appreciate if you would consider subscribing, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye, everyone.